Hi everyone, my name is Nidia Adile. I'm the President and CEO of Protection Real Estate Group, a one-stop real estate consortium that seeks to innovate and provide solutions to the real human problems in the real estate sector. We are on a rescue mission to make home ownership and participation in the real estate sector more accessible to Nigerians. I'm here to introduce to you about our introduction of monetization policy on land investments. Yes, we have just introduced a new policy which is called monetization policy on land investments. Now, this monetization uh, policy is, of course, to enhance our land investment offers, which is aimed at encouraging land banking towards a secured future economy and generational wealth transfer. Now, at Perfection Real Estate, the purpose of uh, our engaging in land is for our, our investors, for Nigerians, to bank in land, you know, towards a secured future economy and generational wealth transfer. And of course, we are doing a lot of things, even outside the box, to make it possible for the average person you know, to participate in the real estate sector by doing one thing or the other, which we provide to encourage and to enhance their economy. Right. So, um, question goes to us what is the monetization policy all about? What is the unitization policy uh, all about? Well, it's a product of innovation, the fulfillment of our mission. Our mission, once again, is to make home ownership and participation in the real estate sector more accessible to Nigerians. So the unitization policy is about the breaking down of land in all our population estate locations into units in terms of square meter to enable several possibilities in land banking. Right, we are doing it to enable several possibilities such as invest and cash out, which is to invest in land for the purpose of cashing out when the uh, price increases, when it appreciates. Invest to flip, that is to buy in order for the for you to be able to sell, you know, at a good value in future. Then invest for the next generation, which is to invest with your children in mind, probably buying in their names, right? And of course, to buy for residential purpose, commercial purpose, institutional, recreational, and so on and so forth. So the bottom line is that we have broken down land into units in terms of the square meter, which means one square meter is one unit. That is what I was talking about now. Of course, uh, why do we introduce the utilization policy? Right? The utilization policy is introduced in order to make land banking much more easier and accessible to the average Nigerian. You know, we're particular about the average Nigerian participating in the real estate sector. Right? So, this is to encourage that participation. Get the point now. According to our own mission, we want to fulfill the mission. We have a mission that we are that is driving us. So, as helping us to think outside the bus about how to make people engage in this thing so that economic power can be strong. You know, and one of the best ways, of course, to bank in land. And securitization of every investor's units of investment in the land. Of course, your, your, your investment is backed by land. You know, some investments are backed by gold. You know, there are some investments that are backed by, you know, before, before uh, 1971, for example, every currency is backed by gold. Right, so the, the same thing we are trying to do here, whereby you know your your your, your units of investment is like a security, it's like a security, right? So 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 it is backed by land. So every unit you have is backed by a a, 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 a tangible asset you know, that makes it real and that makes it appreciate when that the value of that uh, a unit appreciate as well. That is the kind of thing we are trying to achieve here. And now it's now sold in uh export of 200 square meters. Of course, uh, for you to take percent of land, right, 
That is, if you want to take 50% of land, that must be a multiple of 200 square meter. You get the point. For example, you want to buy uh, a plot of land of 600 square meter. What we are trying to, what we are trying to do, let's say, we are trying to buy 200 square meter in three units, in three, maybe multiples of three. You get the point. So that is what we are trying to do now. The reason for this is because, because we are broken down to smaller units, right? People can actually invest. In the unit, if you can invest on one square meter, two square meter, ten square meter, hundred square meter. But if you want to take possession of land, the land will be available to you for whatsoever purpose. Whether it is invest to flip, it is invest to cash out, it is invest for your children, it is invest so that you can do your uh, housing scheme or, or personal uh, 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 housing, it is available. But we are always saying that. We only measure it in multiple of 200 square meter, which means that oh, I need 600 square meter for the stamps. Buy three units. I, I, I even need 400 square. Meter. I mean, I mean, I mean, 800 square meter. Buy four units. I need 1,200 square meter. That means you're going to buy six. No, you can you can just like that. That is what we're talking about. So it makes it possible, you know, for you to be able to you know engage in these things, you know, with, with ease without you no know, stress. Right, that is uh, another uh, beauty of it. Then, other, the po other possibilities enabled by the unitization policy. Let's check the one of our data. One, it comes with a 24 month automatic payment spread, which means that from henceforth, right, every of our landed properties get comes with an automatic 24 month spread payment spread right so that is what another fantastic thing about it of course you can buy as much as you can in multiples of the price per square meter now of course because we are broken down uh, uh, every unit of the land I mean every piece of the land to units right so the land will be, will be priced in terms of that units we hear anything like one thousand dollar per square meter Thousand per square meter, that's what you'll be hearing from us from N Sports. So, in, it now means that you can buy as much as you can in the multiple of price, but you can buy 100 square meter, you can buy 200 square meter, you can buy 1000 square meter, you can buy 10,000 square meter. It depends on the use to which you want to apply, you know, the investments. That's what we're talking about right now. Of course. 25% discount on outright payment because we have a 24 month payment spread and it comes with a price, right? In total, right? Now, it is not out of place that say, look, I want to buy and pay now, right? That's not out of place. So, you have, for that reason, we, we are giving you a whooping 25% discount, right? On, on the price. Let me use an example. You want to buy a, uh, a land, right? And after putting it together, it comes to 1,000. That's an example, right? I'm not saying that's the price. That's an example. 1,000, uh, uh, 100,000 Naira, so to say. Now, because you are not paying for 24 months, you are paying outright pay. You're going to get a 25% discount, right, from uh, at the price, which means I'm going to pay instead of 100,000, I'm going to pay 75,000 naira. That's an example now. So, because you are paid outrightly, right? So, that's another wonderful thing about it. Then, apart from that, too, I want to pay for six months, you want to pay for 12 months, you want to pay for 18 months, they are all available and they all have their discount rates, right? They, they will elaborate uh, further as I go ahead, right? So, but I want to know that that is also available for the taking, right, at different uh, levels. And of course, daily, weekly, and monthly payments now possible, right? If you want to pay daily, because it has been broken down to units, right? So, so it's a matter of now making a choice of the location that you want. Probably you want, okay, I want a particular site in Bebeleki and it is sold for 1,500 per square meter. So, okay, what have you done? Okay, I, I can pay 1500 on daily basis, or I can make two units payment on daily basis. 
three thousand on daily basis. Oh, I can do that. that. That's very easy for me. I will do it until probably for sixty days, and then it amounts to so I'm so so amount of money, and I paid for. You know, that is very very possible now because of the digitalization. Then of course weekly payments, monthly payments. I mean, it's just your call right now. It makes it possible, makes it easy for you, you know, to buy into, to invest in. So that is the possibilities that come on board based on the digitalization policy. Of course, the break, distance breakdown, discount breakdown, right? So, like I said, you want to make an outright payment, right, on the price of 24 months, you get a whooping 25% discount on your payment, right? If you want to go for six months, 50% discount, you know, that will apply. That you want to make a payment for six months, you know, could be. Okay, the, 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 the land is one thousand like 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 the earlier example. Well, I want to pay out try. That means you are paying seven thousand naira. Well, I want to pay for six months. That means you are paying eighty thousand naira because you have been giving twenty percent discount. Then maybe you want to you want to do a, a twelve months payment. They are giving fifteen percent discount, right? Which is it's at thousand naira if you want to if you want to use a thousand naira as a benchmark. I want to pay. Of 18 months, of course, you get the whole 10% discount, which is like okay, I'm paying 90,000 instead of 100,000 and this, this instance. You get it for so you have discounts at different levels, so it makes it easy, right? So, apart from that, too, the daily, weekly, and monthly payments are also there. So, so you can break it down, it makes it a lot easier for you to invest in, it makes it easier for you to buy, it makes it easier for you to pay for, right? And this is exactly what we aim at achieving. To make land banking much more easier, make it much more accessible. People that never dreamt of having land or having investment in land or anything that to do with land can now come in and make it possible for them. So, another attractions about the investment policy, right? Of course, invest and cash out option available for much longer. Yes, okay, right. Invest and cash out option now available. Right from one square meter, so somebody can say, "Oh, I want to invest in one square meter." It is very, very possible. Why not? Right, and of course, that well, one square meter can be paid for for twenty-four months, or outright, or six months, or I mean, it depends. It's just your call. You can pay for it anyhow, daily, weekly, whatever, depending on how easy it is for you. So we have made our administration possible to to be able to take care of all these things. Right, so that is the another I mean interesting thing about it. Of course, clients that couldn't complete payment for land can come back to invest in cash out. Because before now, based on our experience, many people want to buy into land and they want to pay for, you know, they want to have a payment spread. But most of the time, we found that along the line, some people are not able to complete payments. They're not able to, and in such cases, they either, I mean, the money, their money got get lost or they become discouraged or something like that. Nature, they're unable to, or they, when they even refund the money, the money is uh, like. What is uh, deducted along that new charges, but that no longer applies now because even if you can no longer continue, that in, that land that you cannot can be converted to investment, right? And of course, you can even cash out you know big time in the course of time, right? This is that that's, that's not possible rather than you lose, rather than you having I mean having to be frustrated because of no commitment, there are actually an advantage for you right now that oh, that money can be converted to investment and cash out. You know, I mean, with, with, with even much money than you ever paid in, right? That is another beauty of it. Now, for piece of liquidity and trading the units, of course, do that. Real estate, real estate, by virtue of, I mean, what it is, it is not a liquid kind of business, which means that it cannot be converted to cash immediately, unlike unlike other like stocks and shares. Those ones are converted to cash easily. But real estate is said to be illiquid, which means that you cannot you cannot want to sell real estate today and say tomorrow you get the money. So so that that is the difference. Even though it's uh, real estate is very beautiful, but that is the area I mean where people can when people have a little bit of issues. But now it has become easy by by transition because because people I mean these things can easily be exchanged with other people. You get the pronoun. So it makes liquidity easier for you. You can easily sell your Part of your units, part of your, you know, you can, you can do a lot of things. You get the point. You can trade on your units, right? You can, you can, you can, you can somebody can buy over from you. Don't buy other people. Probably buy what you have, what you have, or sell, or you sell part of what you have. You know, you know maybe you give somebody a discount from the company's company's uh, 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 standard, company's prices, so that you can quickly, uh, somebody can quickly give you cash. 
you know, and you sell it right, you know, they give you it to the person. You know, that kind of, all kind of things are possible, you know, by virtue of this situation policy right now. So, so it makes it a wonderful idea that you should look into. Now, I will not forget to always talk about the United Nations report on Nigeria, which is that by the year 2050, right, Nigeria, Nigerian population will be uh, 450 million people and 60% of that population will be the youth. It's already happening now. If you look around you, all you will find that we have more youths, you know, that have more energy to get uh, uh, and, and, and I mean, want to become, want to try, achieve things, right? So, so this also, part of this, uh, uh, whatever it is, like people that want to settle down, people that want something that makes a lot of things to, in order to make their life better. And this also affects real estate too, in terms of demand for land. There will be a lot of demand for land for human activity and several development. And that is exactly the reason why we talk about banking in land. So it's like holding, you know, a piece of the earth. You get the point now. So that when it is demanded for, when it is happy, when it is developed, people will pay more for it. We pay you more for for that. And that is the, the guiding principle. That is the reason why we are we are going the route of land banking. It's very important for every Nigerian to want to bank uh, in land and of course secure your future economy and of course for the national wealth transfer. I hope and pray that you have been educated you know, better and understand you know, this uh, utilization policy uh, much more easier than uh, before. And of course if you have further questions, right, just uh, Call our numbers. Call the number of the person that either sends you this. So call our number. Our number will actually be uh, displayed along with the person. I mean, the sending of this video to you, so you can call the numbers uh, and, and then make more further inquiry. And I think it will be better for you. So thank you very much for listening to me. Uh, I hope that uh, we we'll hear from you very soon. Thank you. I appreciate you. Bye bye.